everybody this is Audrey also known as Noble Strength and welcome back to my channel and as you can see by the title below this is an update on Posh Marking as well as review of the Brahmin handbags so the reason why I'm kind of compiling those two topics together is first of all I made my purchases on Poshmark and I am a Poshmark seller so just to let you know Poshmark is a platform where you can buy and sell items and you can make a profit you can have that money directly deposited into your account or you can let your sales credits accumulate and you can use those credits to making purchases within the parsing community which is what I did to acquire one of these bags now the first thing that I want to say if you have a Poshmark account but you don't have a closet you just use that account just to shop fabulous but do your research before you buy always research because people will try to get on over on you people are all about making the profit and trying to get as much money as they can now me being a reseller I know that you can go out there and buy things for little or nothing and then you can mark up the price and somebody out there who hasn't done their research will just buy it but you know it's really it's not that you're trying to take advantage of people people just need to be smart shoppers that's what I believe I personally don't try to mark up and get over on people me personally but there are people out there who will do that um, and I say that to say if you are really really wanting something there's this thing of supply and demand if you're really wanting something you're going to pay the money because you want it and it's no problem and then you're not a victim that's just you getting something that you need um, I was a business major and marketing uh, was my you know concentration when I majored in business so I know a little bit about the marketing side and how that all that works but I just say that to say be a smart shopper okay so now that I've gotten that out the way as far as my closet goes sometimes if you have a closet it's good to constantly uh, take stock of how things are going self-reflect reevaluate you know what's going on why things are not selling maybe you need to refresh your closet maybe things are looking a little stale maybe your buyers are being turned off by every time they come to the source the same old thing and nothing's turning over so every now and then if you see your sales aren't going take those things out of your closet and restock with some new fresher items another thing is be consistent about uploading and bringing in inventory um, I was bad about that and I know that is one of the reasons why I had not been making the sales uh, that I had made when I uh, first started so those are just some things to consider uh, from the business side of Poshmark okay now having said all of that guys I had a wish list of some handbags uh, you know I tell people all the time have a wish list of things that you want and work towards that getting that and there are a bunch of different ways you can work towards that being an avid thrifter keeping your eye out um, shopping online you know putting aside money monthly towards you know the things that you want to get having that little stockpile so that when the things that you want comes you can just get it without uh, too much thought so anyway uh, there are two Brahmin handbags that I bought on Poshmark. Now, I first purchased my first two Brahmin handbags from this place called Uptown, Uptown Cheapskates. You've heard me mention it before. It's a chain of, you know, buying and reselling type things. And I, I do a lot of my selling there as well. And that's how I got my first two bags. Now, who introduced me to Brahmin? One of my good friends who I go to church with. Hi, Alice. Thank you so much. She is such a stylish woman. She walked into church and that she's always making a statement when she comes in. But this particular handbag caught my eye that she had. And I was like, where in the world did you get that? Who is that by? And so when she told me, I'd never heard of the Brahmin handbag. This was some time ago. But it was such a high quality bag I knew that I wanted to own one and so I then went to cheapskate because I knew I 
at the time could not afford to just buy it outright new from the store but anyway that's how I got mine but I've sold those bags since then and for a long time uh, since I sold those bags I did not have any Brahmins so these are my only two Brahmins that I have that I'm going to show you now they just got them today so I'm happy to share them with you the first one that I got is this anywhere convertible and it is in the color pecan and it is genuine leather so this is croc embossed what I love this beautiful color now the one that I previously owned it wasn't anywhere convertible but it was in like a caramel color and it really didn't lend itself to go with a lot of things like I wanted them to like I wanted it to so this color I think will go with more and this will probably be an everyday bag for me I will probably carry this a lot and so um, it comes with your standard uh, beautiful you got your Brahmin name here your Brahmin medallion here with the ship Brahmin is printed on the gold hardware that we have like even on the zipper pulls well not on this one but on the other one but you have it on here on the little brass things it has a back slip uh, pocket which is very roomy so you can put your phone in there on the slide side for on the go it has your roll stitch handles what I love about this bag is you can hand carry it or you can carry it on the crook of your arm or you can carry it as a crossbody because it does have this adjustable strap that is removable and I love this I carry mine as a crossbody so here I should say I when I had the other one I carried it as a crossbody I just got this one but I will be carrying this one as a crossbody it does have your four feet which I love and let me go ahead and take all this stuffing out still got the silica packs and all that in there so I have never purchased a brand new new with tags Brahmin so all that I'm going to show you is what it comes with it comes with your registration card it comes with the key fob you have a zip pocket with the leather trim around it you have your slip pockets or kangaroo pockets with the leather trim at the top it also has a slip slots or slots for your pins which is really nice and it's this velvety uh, interior that has Brahmin printed on it very very roomy so I just adore this bag I am more of a small medium type bag girl so this bag is actually the perfect size for me and once again let me give you an overall look of the bag so that's it from the side again from the front and the back and you got your handles and then of course your feet on the bottom so this is the anywhere convertible and the uh, original price on this was $245 but I got it for $170 and the next and it did come with the Brahmin dust bag that you can store it in so the next bag that I acquired on Poshmark was my dream bag which I now have uh, this was on my wish list for quite a while this is the Hudson Satchel and what I love about this bag guys is the contrast of the Casper with the leopard print against this beautiful croc embossed leather at the bottom. It's a very substantial bag. It's very big. For me it would be considered a large but I know for other people this will probably be a medium bag but this is definitely a large to me. But this bag I've had my eye on for quite a while. At least for a little over a year. Maybe a year now. But when I first saw this bag last year I fell in love with the bag. And I it was $275 on Poshmark and I knew it was a good deal because originally the original price is like 400 and something like 420 425 somewhere in there and so I knew it was a good deal but I heed hauled around holding out hoping that I could get a better deal and you know sometimes you can just hee haw around too much and miss out and that's what happened somebody else grabbed it up and I so regretted it but you know everybody every time has its I mean everything has its season there's a time and place for everything so it wasn't meant for me to have that bag and I learned a lesson that if you really want something save up for it and that way you don't have to hee haw around about it but anyway so long story short I run across this bag again now this particular 
Hudson satchel is a pretty classic standard style for Brahmin. However, you know, it comes in many different colors and uh, they, you know, do their own different spin on this shape of bag. But this particular style with the leopard print is a rare find. There's not a lot of them on the market right now. I think they only made so many and then they just didn't make any more. And evidently people are loving the bag and keeping them because there's not a lot of them up for sale. So I had to wait at least what I guess maybe eight or nine more months before I even saw the bag again and to see it in good condition you know what I mean so I saw this one new with tags on Poshmark but it was 400 she had it marked at no she had it marked I think at five something and I knew that was way too much because it was only originally for something so I was like, I, I gotta have that bag. I want that bag. And I knew I had my credits from my sales on my Parchmark car. I was like, I'm getting that bag and I'm gonna use my credits towards that bag. So I went back and forth with her. I made a bid, she declined it. Then I made another bid and then she counter offered and we came to 480. Now I knew that was still over the original price. However, I knew I had my credit. So it, to me, it didn't matter because I accumulated my credit. So I actually got it at a good deal using my credits, which is awesome. So long story short, I got it brand new with tags, which is better than the offer before because the other one wasn't brand new with tags. Not only that, this one came with the matching wallet so i think that's why she had it priced the way she did because she was also including the wallet and the checkbook with it so now that i've said all that let's go ahead and review this bag so this is the hudson satchel in morrison brown if i'm not mistaken and like i said it's the contrasting the cast fur with the printed leopard this is what it looks like from the side you've got your leather trim all the way around your smooth leather trim against the croc embossed then you have your feet on the bottom which is awesome your back is all croc embossed with a slip pocket which i love for your phone and it has your standard like brahmin medallion and all of that and so you've got your dual pulls and i'm going to open it up and show you you've got your crossbody strap which you gotta have I love a crossbody so we got that open it up you've got a zip pocket it comes with your of course your registration card there you go and this one it was called it's Hudson Satchel Morris Brown Morrison yeah so it is a Brown Morrison so you've got your interior with the stripes and the name Brahmin printed on it uh, another zip pocket over here without the leather trim and slip pockets and just really nice bag so let me show you the matching wallet to this beauty right here awesome so you got your matching wallet here and um, you open it up and you've got your checkbook as well and I still do use my checkbook it comes with the pen also so I thought it was really really cool to get both these items uh, brand new with tags and hey I'm gonna register these babies and I'm gonna be carrying them and I do not think I will be selling them if you have any questions about either of the bags um, comment below maybe you have the bags yourself and you want to comment on you know how they have you know worn with you for the time that you've had them do you have a brahmin i'd love to hear from you are you a brahmin uh person and uh that's all i wanted to share with you i just wanted to give you an update on parshmark give you some tips and share with you my deals so if you're out in the market for a brahmin handbag do not pass up uh shopping on parshmark i think they have some really great deals and once again this is audrey also known as noble strength encouraging you to be a good steward of all that God has given you because he truly loves us so very much and I'd love to hear from you if you like videos like this um, handbag reviews thrift hauls if you like being encouraged and uh, being uplifted this is the channel for you please subscribe and I will see you next time bye